I've been suffering from some pretty serious back pain recently. And that really drives home the point for me that I'm just a uh, weak little mortal. I'm not going to live forever. As I get older, my body is going to work less well. So once I'm fully healed, I want to kind of live cautiously reckless. If you have any ideas for some extreme sports that I can get into, links, maybe discounts, I want to live it up, you know, kind of go out on top as they said before they died. Uh, NASA, if you're seeing this, you know, uh, I can still be an astronaut. I'm 28 in two days. Um, give me a call or um, send a business inquiry to uh, Squirrel Dove Borkaf. Um, I'm going to have some free time coming up. Samuel went to his cave to collect shells. One Fine day, he found a shell that spoke to him. It said, Samuel, go north. You'll find peace. <laughs> Samuel went north and found some thing peaceful but it wasn't peace itself <laughs> so he went back to <laughs> his shell and asked shell what are you going to do about this the shell replied, Well, Samuel, it's been one week since I first talked to you. And you have grown unkind. <laughs> so I will punish. Oh, oops, sorry. Yeah. <laughs> I, I love it. I love it. Punish. <laughs> you. <laughs> Harshly. By. Tickling. Your. Innards. With. <laughs> my. Clam tongue. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> my. Gosh. Shell. Exclaimed. <laughs> and. Then they both realized they had found peace at last. <laughs> Yay! <laughs> oh, great. What a beautiful story. Yeah. And we didn't die. Yeah, I know. <laughs> it was the peace of Samuel that kept us going.